grown commercially and sold at the supermarket are much cheaper, I've decided to start my own organic garden. Why? Because I'm an idiot. You heard, it's much harder for me to grow my own small, limited crops. Without the use of pesticides and fertilizers, not only do I have much greater pest problems and greater deficiencies in the plants, I also don't get to take part in the destruction of the ozone. You heard, without using pesticides, I don't get to take part in the destruction of the ozone, the contribution to environmental destruction, and a plethora of other harmful activities to our environment. Why would I not want to take part in all this, you might ask? The reason is simple. I'm not very smart. I prefer to grow my own basil, or spicy pepper, rather than buy it at the supermarket. Never mind that it takes up more time and requires physical labor, I also have a shortage of basil during the winter, when basil dies. Instead of picking out my cauliflower, lettuce, and onions at the supermarket, I have to spend several hours a week watering, tending, and weeding out my little seedlings so that one day I might be able to eat a half-grown cauliflower. So don't be like me. Don't be an idiot. Be like everybody else and buy genetically modified fruits and vegetables at the supermarket. Supermarkets. The smart choice. Harmful effects may include contribution to the three major greenhouse gases, carbon dioxide from the use of fossil fuels, nitrogen oxide from the use of chemical fertilizers, and methane from factory farming. According to the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, atmospheric concentration of CO2 has increased from a pre-industrial concentration of about 280 parts per million to 379 parts per million in 2005. Industrial agriculture is also more vulnerable to climate change, which is intensifying droughts and floods. Monocultures lead to more frequent crop failure when rainfall does not come in time, or is too much or too little. Chemically fertilized soils have no capacity to withstand the drought, and cyclones and hurricanes make the food system dependent on long-distance transport and highly vulnerable to destruction. Means. Do you buy your music? I know I. I spend hundreds of dollars every month buying all kinds of music. I used to believe I should pay artists for their music. But then I realized artists have shitloads of money.